All right, good morning, everyone. Today we're here in beautiful Moonaki, New Jersey with Mr. Sungkook Burns, acorn expert, and his son, Valen Burns, uh, here to tell us about the great new acorn harvest of 2016. So, Mr. Burns, tell us about this acorn harvest. Is yeah. it an exceptional year? It's, it's been a great year, you know, looking at the almanac, acorning almanac of 2016, and they were right. Record year, we had the record rainfall, so good. These acorns are falling like bullets in the skies. Now, are you worried for your safety with all these acorns coming down everywhere? Yeah, you know, but the the, the good people at Acorn Hill invented a nice acorn protection umbrella. So, little Valen here has been, been uh, putting that to good use, and we've been, we've been good. We've only had seven deaths so far, so that's, that's pretty good. But Acorn, you can see by these markings that this is a grade A A A acorn, triple A acorn, right, Valen? What do you think? Do you think triple A or maybe just a double A? Ah, uh, double A. We don't take double A's. We only take triple A's in here. So there's different qualities of acorn. What do you look for when you're searching for the right acorn? This grade A A A A A acorn. Oh no, not but quadruple A or quintuple A. If you have one of those, those are like million dollar acorns. And million it, dollar acorns. I mean, Moonaki, New Jersey is the acorn capital of the world, but the only place you can get quintuplet rated A acorns is in Jamaica. Okay. But they don't have that many acorns, but they do have the best acorns. Jamaica. Yeah. Now, does your son ever help you in sorting out quality acorns? Yeah, quality you know. You gotta start them young. If they wanna be any good sort of acorner, they gotta start around two, three months. Some people say you can start at five months, but I don't think so. It's gotta be that two, you know, two month mark, I think is a sweet spot. So we, we actually kind of cheated and started him at a month, a month old. So now you can see, you know, he knows how to sort these things. He just knocks off the bad ones and puts on the good ones. He so, just, yeah, see, woo! all these are bad. And he just knew that he sort of just bad acorns at once. You get, you know, you well, get. That is impressive. It is impressive. You get these 60 year olds have been doing it all their lives, but they started, you know, at five months. Oh, they five? don't got it. They don't got it like he does. What, what do you think of this one, Valen? Uh, is that a good one or a bad AAA one? Triple A acorn. Yeah, he's got to inspect it. This one, some of them are tricky, you know, they're borderline. Do oh, God, double A acorn. I see, just gone. You, just you, you couldn't tell, right? Just look like another acorn to you. I couldn't tell. You. I couldn't yeah. tell. See, yeah. this, this bundle, this bat, bushel of acorns right here, this probably sells for around, eh, $2, $3. Oh, does it really? Yeah, but if, you had, if these were double A acorns, it'd be nothing. You'd just see them, like, on the bottom of trees. No one would even be picking them up. They'd just be leaving them there. Can you believe that? Amazing. See, but you get a triple A reader like this guy, he sorts them out and you get two whole dollars. What for about this bushel. one, Valen? Uh, he knows, he knows. A man who knows he, what he wants. Valen, find me find me a triple A acorn and put it in the bucket. Find me a triple A. Ah, uh, see? He didn't even have to think about it. Well, this has uh, been very informative and um, good luck with the rest of the harvest and uh, we'll catch you next year. From all of us here at News 12 Munaki, have a good day. Annual tradition here at the Great Acorning Festival in Munaki, New Jersey. We toss this bucket of acorns. Okay.